On the Gulf Coast this evening, it is no hurricane, but Tropical Storm Lee may bring dangerous flooding. Lee is a slow-moving storm. The Weather Service tells us it may hold 10 to 15 inches of rain. Warnings are up from Mississippi to Texas. A storm surge could raise water levels 2 to 4 feet. Bagad Shaban is south of New Orleans in Lafitte, Louisiana. Well, Scott, this is Bayou Barataria, which goes right through this coastal community. The Gulf of Mexico actually feeds into it. And so the fear is that the storm could send waters rushing in, overtopping the banks, and into homes nearby, just really just a few feet away. And so city crews spent much of the afternoon lining these sandbags in some of the most vulnerable areas to fight the flood. Tropical Storm Lee started lashing Lafitte with rain this morning. 84-year-old Ida Mae Darda and her 89-year-old husband live just three feet above sea level. This is the one we hoping don't happen again, this one right here with all that water. Three years ago, Hurricane Gustav turned their driveway into a river and left their living room a moldy mess. At our age, it would be hard to go through that again because everything has to go. You have to pick up everything. Everything has to go. Mayor Tim Kerner predicts 30% of the homes here, including Ida Mays, are in danger. As bad as it is to fight these, these, these hurricanes, I mean, it, it, it's really tough, but I mean, it, it, it's tougher if you're actually living in a house that's below elevation and you take a chance on losing everything again. The threat of flash floods prompted Louisiana's governor to declare a state of emergency. That water's going to pile up. It, it's going to come so quickly and for such a long period of time, it's not going to be able to drain. But the Army Corps of Engineers has no concerns about the 120-mile levee system that protects New Orleans. This is one of the gates right here. Colonel Edward Fleming says floodgates have been lowered to guard the city after Katrina, $10 billion were spent to improve protection. Uh, we're confident that this system will be able to perform as designed. The levees offer no security to the Dardas. They live outside the protection zone and are surrounded by water. It would be a total on us. I wouldn't want to go through it again. And the storm could also hurt people at the gas pumps. Half of U.S. oil production in the Gulf of Mexico, Scott, has been shut down until Lee passes. Begad, thank you very much.